Okay, I have to get you. Oh my god, Pudgy. Oh my god, that was the hardest thing I ever had to do in my life. A tornado flew around my whole neighborhood and took out the power for like a week. Hey, what is up you guys? It's Jess and I'm back. Guess who's back? Back, back, back again. I have a whole lot of energy, which I don't know why. I really don't know why, because I could barely sleep last night because people were, you know, kind of getting rid of the trees in the street. Yeah, um, the whole tornado in Jersey, that happened here. It was pretty bad. Good noise. Thank you, not like I'm trying to film a video. It's fine. Yes. I've been an MII from YouTube for a couple weeks now and not having power to edit or film videos probably isn't helping. I don't know when I'll be able to get this video up. I'm filming it today. Wednesday, June 24th. And let's see when this video goes up. <laughs> so, reasons that I haven't been on YouTube. Power's one, but that's only technically probably been a week. The other times, I filmed videos and I had a lot of videos to like edit, but I kept looking back at them and they weren't funny and they weren't really what I wanted to make videos of, so I just kind of deleted them and I'm starting fresh. To my new subscribers, hello, welcome to the fam. It's fun, it was a good time. Also, want to give a shout out to one of my subscribers that follow me on Instagram, Rockstar3468. Shout out to you, girl. Much love. I don't know what this is. I guess complete the heart. I'm going to be doing a summer essentials video because it's summer. Bye. Finally, my first essential slash tip will be to have a beach bag ready at all times because you never know when you're gonna go on a spontaneous beach trip. Keep a plastic bag in it for wet bathing suits because nobody thinks of that but you put on a bathing suit but you need something to put it back in that isn't going to get everything else wet so always have a plastic bag because I always throw my wet bathing suits and towels in it and it works. Dick Duba. This is mine. It's really big. Uh, it's from Victoria's Secret. I got it free with like a purchase but it's actually a really nice bag. It's like canvas and leather huge. There are no pockets, which kind of suck, but I just kind of throw everything in there and hope for the best. I also would recommend keeping a bathing suit, it could be like an old one, and an old towel in your car because you never know when you're going to go to the beach. Also, if you have a car, I would recommend carrying an easy pass because the tolls are no bueno and it would be a lot easier, see what I did there, if you had an easy pass. So I would get one of those. Kind of a dead giveaway, but sunglasses. These are pretty sweet from American Eagle. They're floral. I'll model them for you. <laughs> and I also have these, which I've been wearing a lot from Urban Outfitters. I got them last year, but I think you can still wear them. Um, another essential that I always have with me is a baseball hat, cap, whatever you want to call it. This one is from Taylor Swift's 1989 tour, which was amazing, and I took videos of it and edited them all on my vlog channel, Mega JK Films, subscribe. But they all got taken down for copyrights, and if I post another one, my account will be terminated. Yay! These two, baseball cat, I kind of switched between the three, but I've really been wearing this one because Taylor Swift, Avi. This one is super old, and you... You can probably get something similar like it at Urban Outfitters, but this was my dad's from like the 60s, so vintage. And this one's just from American Eagle, it's just uh, okay, good focusing. Alright, thank you camera. It's just this floral one, which I wore a lot last year, but I don't really wear it this year. Oh, lash tattoos. Oh, ah! They're just super cool temporary tattoos because your girl does not have a tattoo. This needles scare me a lot. So would recommend carrying cash with you because you never know if you're gonna go out to eat or if you're at the beach, no, you're gonna have to spend money. Come on, people. The board rocks right there. Is there softy cores? Oh, bless. It's always, always wear sunscreen, especially to my fellow pasty girls out there. Just embrace the paste and wear sunscreen. For makeup for the summer, I would honestly just recommend not wearing any foundation. I'm sure there's like different brands that's like good for the sun and SPF and that's gonna stay on. 
but at the end of the day your makeup's gonna get patchy and start sweating down and it's just not gonna look good and you look better with just no makeup like i have no foundation on now i have some pimples up here but i'm wearing a baseball hat so you can't see them so just wear this and some sunglasses and nobody will notice honestly nobody notices if you're wearing makeup in the summer or not unless it's like at night inside so just don't bother people <sighs> I really wish I had power right now. You don't know the struggle. I did not choose the Amish life, and the Amish life is starting to choose me, and I'm not feeling it. If you found this video helpful and you're happy I'm back because I, oh my god, my hair, <sighs> and subscribe because I will now be posting new videos every week. I know I was gone, but I'm back. It's summer, and everybody has time to go in the summer. Duh. Also, like I said before, subscribe to my vlog channel and maybe check your films because. I'm gonna be posting a lot on there, especially because it's summer, because I actually go places for summer. I have friends? Oh my god. Yeah, I do. Like five, but still. Anyway. <laughs> Bye, guys.